Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm Clara and today I'm going to be doing the ride or die tag and I've been tagged by my lovely friend Tyson so I'm gonna leave her link on her YouTube channel down below so you can check her out because she's amazing and she's super 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 um, friendly and cute so make sure you check her channel out. This video was supposed to be a makeup tutorial but this happened no idea of cooking so I cut myself with a knife. For those of you who don't know about this tag, it's basically my holy grail products. Um, yeah, that basically explains everything. So I'm going to start with a primer and my holy grail primer is this L'Oreal Paris Lumi Magic Pure Light Primer and I have to say that this is amazing. What I've been doing recently is that I'm not using any foundation. I just put this primer first on my face. After moisturizing it, my face instantly looks luminous and so, so healthy and I highly recommend it because it's like uh, wearing highlighter but you're not wearing highlighter, you know? So for foundation, I'm going to pick this Maybelline Fit Me foundation in the shade 225 but I'm not very, very happy with the shade. I think I'm on a lighter tone, but I love this formula. I always use like light, medium, coverage foundation. So this one is so good because your skin looks so natural and it doesn't stick, it doesn't crack, it doesn't look cakey, so it is so good. But this is not my tone because, well, I'm not as tan as I used to be like two months ago, but yeah. So for concealer, I'm going to go with this Maybelline, it's that Maybelline, that's Maybelline. I'm going to go with this Maybelline Instant Anti-Age Concealer because I really love this sponge and it is so easy to apply it under your eyes and I also use it as um, you know, to highlight this zone. Ooh. It looks so perfect and natural with a beauty blender and it looks so 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 good on my skin. For powder, I'm using the this Essence All About Matte Fixing Compact Powder and I use it to set my makeup. Oh my, oh, so sorry guys. So I use it to set my makeup on and my skin looks so 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 smooth and it looks like silk. It doesn't look cakey. It is so, so, um, like a second skin per se, I like that. For a bronzer and to contour as well, I use this Maxi Delight uh, bronzer from Bourjois. I really love how my skin looks so good after using it because it looks tan, it looks healthy. It is so good and it is so beautiful. It is also so blendable and I really love how easy it is to apply it on my cheekbones. I'm not wearing it right now so I just don't look at my face but um, it's so good. My Holy Brave product is this Too Faced Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar and look at the colors. I think they are perfect. I have brown. Um, eyes, so this bluish colors and all these uh, like gold, brownish, uh, pinkish colors are perfect for my brown eyes, so I think this is the perfect eyeshadow palette for my eyes, so yeah. Also they are so pigmented and they are also so easy to blend and so easy to apply, so the makeup, it's not like difficult to do and that's what I really like about this palette. And they really last on your eyes so that's something I really look for in a palette. Something that lasts forever or lasts all day or all night and you know I've tried so many that you apply it on your eyes and then within 10 minutes you have nothing in your eyes so what's the point? I'm going to go with eyeliner right now and my all time favorite eyeliner is this Kiko Waterproof Eyeliner. I'm always looking for liquid eyeliners because I don't know why I really don't like the other ones. I also look for a thin, I don't know if you can see it, 
for a thin applicator because I'm not very good with thick ones. The formula is so strong and it is really waterproof and it doesn't go away that easily. So I really love this eyeliner for that also. Sometimes I struggle when I have to remove it. Also, it is so easy to draw a line in my eyes. I don't know, I think this depends on the person. I personally like uh, this type of eyeliners, but maybe you hate it and prefer all the things. So. For my lashes, I really like the Maybelline Volume Press Mascara because, well, the applicator is, as you can see, it has like a uh, curve there that helps to add that extra of volume to my lashes. I really like how my lashes look afterwards because my eyes look open, wide and with amazing lashes and yeah, I don't really uh, wear false lashes because of this and I don't know, I really like this mascara. Now let's move on to my cheeks and my holy grey blush is this a slick one is this a uh, coral orangey a strange colour that I really love and maybe I will have to change this because this is like more for a summery um, look when you're very tan but yeah I really like this and I've been using this a lot what I've been doing and that I love so much is that I'm applying this colour also here on my on the crease and it looks like your even tanner. So yeah that's a tip for you guys. This slip blush is really 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 pigmented and just need a little bit of um of product in your cheeks and you're done. So for highlighter my holy grey and favorite highlighter from all this world is this Mary Luminizer by the Balm. Unfortunately, it's broken. This is really pigmented and you just need like a little tiny, tiny, tiny bit of highlighter on your cheeks and you really, really bright. Like a disco ball. Like really, it's like a natural glow. It's not like a really artificial glow. So I'm going to finish with uh, lipsticks. I don't know why, but I have like two holy products for my lips and I just can't choose one. One of them is this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in shade Can, and it's the perfect pinkish nude for an everyday look and I'm wearing it right now. The other one is this MAC Velvet Teddy lipstick. It's a really, really... Um, beautiful new lipstick. This is more like pinky, yeah, more of a pinky tone and this one is more of a natural tone so um, yeah, I'm gonna apply it right now. Yeah, those were my ride or die makeup products so I really like to know which one are yours so put them down below on the comments also if you like this video please give it a thumbs up also comment down below i will put the name of the people that i tagged down below in the description box so check it out and yeah i think that's it so thank you so much for watching again and i hope i can see you in the next video